Good morning from the Volcanic Tablelands here in Southern California. Today we're going to talk about the Casa Diablo Circles. This is a uh, collection of 14-ish uh, circles with various um, straight lines across at different angles throughout the uh, panel. Some are, there's one that's really faded. I don't think you can probably see it on camera. It's over in this vicinity here. But this is really astonishing. In my mind, this comes close to 13 moons. I mean, here we have 14 circles, and they all have lines going in different orientations, different directions. Some of the circles are connected, and some are not. Some are free-floating. The uh, panel is in the same curvilinear style of all the other petroglyphs here in the uh, volcanic tablelands, and you see Berkeley has rightfully credited this work to the Mono people. Other than just circles, there's one small little petroglyph. I don't know if you can see it right here. It's kind of beside a larger circle, and it's just more of a rectangle with a... Uh... I keep thinking I'm being watched by Bigfoot. It's kind of a rectangle with a um, sinuous line down through the middle. But it is really remarkable. It's a remarkable find. And I'm not sure why it doesn't get as much press as the other uh, panels here in the Volcanic Tablelands. And in my mind, it should be the fourth premier panel here, right behind Rosetta, 13 Moons, and Skyrock. I mean, it is quite astonishing. But I wouldn't even hazard to guess what these lines across the uh, circles are. I mean, is it how they plowed their fields from season to season? I don't know. I don't think um, the modern people that were that agrarian, especially down here in the volcanic tablelands. Is this a map of a village? You know, each symbol representing a uh, different function of the village. Like this symbol here could be the symbol for the chief. Or another one, another one could be the shaman, maybe. And, and maybe it is a map of... Not just a singular village, but it is a map of a whole bunch of villages up and down the uh, volcanic tablelands. I do not know. Or is it some sort of star map? Is this like the constellation where their gods come from? Still don't know. It really is an enigma. This petroglyph probably dates around you know, 3,000 years old, just like the, other, the, the rest of them. It has not been uh, totally acclaimed by desert varnishing. Desert varnishing is a process where, let's say you chisel a line in a rock, it r appears really bright. The, uh, what is underneath is really bright compared to the surface of the uh, rest of the rock. What happens is over time, these rocks darken because of oxidation, uh, biological oxidation, chemical oxidation with the atmosphere, and they darken. So when you take a, um, a really hard, dense stone and chisel these uh, petroglyphs again these are chiseled they're in deep they're not scratched they're not painted they are chiseled in and so you chisel something <clears throat> the color underneath is brighter and so then you can see an image now over time this will darken these petroglyphs will not be seen as visibly because they, the the images will be the same color as the rest of the uh, rock. You'll have to be right up on it just to see the indentions of the lines they won't last forever one thing I like about this petroglyph that I haven't seen in other petroglyphs is up in here, some of the parts of the circle has been chiseled out is now a uh, is now a home to lichen, a really bright green lichen. Very interesting. Uh, you know, these things are so old, and so much of the information has been lost because of uh, genocide and forced relocation. That knowledge is pretty much gone forever, so we can only just guess. Educated guesses, but we just have to guess. This this cluster here is not the only thing represented on, on the uh, panel. Over here, you can see some more uh, petroglyph. One uh, part partial circle here. Uh, there's some other panels uh, you can see that's also at this site. That's just circles. I don't know if they're creatively linked or they're just another uh, just another panel. This, and this site is in remarkable shape. It is in really, really good shape. 
So that's it here from Casa Diablo Circles here in the volcanic tablelands of Southern California. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you like what I'm doing on this channel, please subscribe. If you got any questions, just drop those in the comments below. And I want to thank all of my Cyworks patrons. You guys are remarkable. Without you, none of this would be happening. So until next time, I'll be your lab partner. Take care. Bye-bye.